the the beatings were apparently severe enough that uh, Jake's knew. I believe she was just your girlfriend at the time. Cheryl was actually uh, yeah. she, Jake was getting some sympathy from her about it, and she was not That's smart. A strap match. <laughs> she was not smart to the business at the time. Jake, I'll let you go ahead and fire off with the story. Yeah, she was. She helped me out of the Omni to the car, and I'm selling it. <laughs> so she comes and opens a door for me and puts me in the car. And I see Rodney coming out. <laughs> and now all, of I, all I can see of her is her belly button on the other side of the car. And I'm like, what the hell is she doing? And I thought, well, she must have lost her keys or something. Well, no, she had her keys because she opened the damn door. So I got out of the car to see what the fuck she was doing. And she had a pistol out. And she was <laughs> aiming at Ronnie. <laughs> <laughs> she was shoot his ass. Well, I'm glad I didn't know that. <laughs> I know that. I sure was. She had a 38, and she was going to bust a couple of caps off at him. My God, that was the night I smartened her up. <laughs> well, you were too convincing. <laughs> yeah, that was it. <laughs> yeah, that could have that, uh, that could have ended the program in a hurry if if Ronnie had oh, gotten shit. shot. 